thought about it all day today. The world we know is about to waste away On both sides and in between We're seeing things that we've never seen Our little piece of paradise Is turning out to be not so nice In a world so full of greed Do we fight? Do we just concede? Say I do Try to stay alive Will we all survive The answer lies inside of me The um, abandoned black church out here in Ashland, West Virginia That is the craziest thing I've ever seen It's crazy, man. So we're having a major malfunction here. You guys got your crosses on tonight? Yep. Yeah. Were you bap were you bap were you baptized in this church? In here? This is a baptism. This is a baptism. This is a baptism. Pool or whatever. What was that? Sitting by this baptism, baptism pool. It's a pretty deep one too. I'd say it's about five feet deep. There's a piece of the floor that lifts up here. There's a ladder that goes down into it. So I felt, I yeah, actually I just felt something right. right here for the first time since we've been in here. So this is just a little weird room here, probably where they came in for baptism. I think this was the other door to, like maybe where they I came mean, in and. Oh, there's a bird. It's okay. Oh, little bird. Oh, nice. Right here, we're on the stage. This is where we set up. And this is probably where they brought the people in who were getting ready to be baptized. And we're just going to kind of walk through this church and see if anything wants to communicate with us. How big these windows are. Wow, this is pretty cool. And the old drop scene is falling down. <coughs> Cool. Oh, it looks a little dangerous. What does it say? Lady, this is a washroom. These are the bathrooms in there. So we're going to come on down. Oh, man, this is cool down here. Oh! Watch the ventilation, y'all. Watch your head. Watch your I'm getting ready to go down. Are you getting hit? It was point one. Oh, it was? Yes. Anybody down here that wants to communicate with us? Three point three point four. We're getting hits on the millimeter. Three point four. We're down in the basement. Come on down. Okay, this basement has more of a feel. Is anybody down here with us? There's a door open down here. Oops. You guys gotta be real careful where you're stepping. So we're down here in the basement. She got to hit a 3.3 .3 on the millimeter when we first come down. 3.4. 3.4. So we are getting some hits on the meters. It feels a little bit more energetic down here. But I think maybe actually what we might have done is we cornered it down here in the stairway and it might have gone up past us. Whatever might have been in here. Um, you, you just don't know. We'll do, a, do an EVP session here. Okay. Is anybody here with us who would like to make their presence known? Is there anybody in here? Who made the spike on the millimeter when we came down? Mm 
Did you used to attend this church? They were just trying to, um, kind of, we're hanging out down here in the basement. Um, these doors are open. Just kind of checking out what's here, getting a feel for the place. Hopefully something here wants to talk to us. So they did say that they heard that there was stuff going on in here, didn't they? Correct. If anything's here, would you like to try to make your presence known? Can you make a noise? Can you move something? So we were sitting upstairs on the stage by the baptism pool. We're going to go back up there and do some more EVPs. And hopefully if something's here with us, they will talk to us. Well, so far, it's got a good feel for it. It's just not sure what we're catching, if anything. This is our first standing church. So <laughs> <laughs> it should be interesting. We're going to go back upstairs. Well, let's hang out right here for a little bit. Okay. Let's have a little bit of a feel to it. So we're just um, in a different room down here in the basement right now. Is that, if anybody's here with us, can you talk to us over that camera? Can you talk into that camera? It's a floor. Doors are kind of knocked down. Still filming, Angie? Yes, ma'am. Okay, what's on this side? Angie's coming to take it back. It's just right here. Hmm. This looks like a little maybe add on. Like that was the original. And they added this portion onto it, huh? Hmm. Weird little space. Hang on, you guys. We're going to be right there. Ah, oh, look at this weird chair in the corner. Yes, ma'am. Like it's like a detention. When you're bad, they stick you in here. Look at them weird little chairs down in there. Maybe. I'd say those are pretty old, huh? Old weird chairs. So if anything's down here, we're going to try to spook it out of here and make it come on upstairs with us. And hopefully, it'll want to interact. <laughs> Be careful. Yeah. Well, we went in the basement. <coughs> it was kind of creepy down there, wasn't it? Yeah, a little bit. But I think we'll be more creeped out over here on the stage. Look at down in there. And then 0 0.7. And then 0 0.1. Cool, we're getting hit on that mill meter. So who's here with us? Can you make them numbers go up on that meter again? So we took a little walk around the church and kind of explored the basement a little bit and it was a little bit creepy. And uh, now we're going to kind of check out this baptism pool. Is this thing pretty heavy? Yeah. It is heavy. Yes ma'am. We're going to set our chairs in there I think. Give me this down there too. Alright, we're going to go down in the baptism pool. <laughs> See if anything wants to communicate with us down here. This is my first time being in one of these when I wasn't being baptized. <laughs> so, um... You got it? So... I'm going to do the DVDs in here. You want to sit down? The instruments. <laughs> and we've got the instruments with us. Oh, something's flying around in there. So we're sitting down here in the baptism chamber inside the church. 
We've been getting hits on this mel meter throughout the church. This was a deep one, huh? I mean, this is a pretty deep one. I've seen them, the one I was baptized in was about half this depth. So, it's pretty big, isn't it? Mm hmm. I've never seen one this big. This is pretty big, isn't it? What do you think? Yeah, it's big. It's a big one. Is there anything evil here? Why do I get that feeling? <laughs> <laughs> I just had that feeling, though. Is anything evil in this church? We're probably the first ones that probably sat down in here doing an EBP session. <laughs> Just went through another set of batteries in about 15 minutes in that camera, and that usually lasts me at least about an hour. Um, I think at some point we corner this stuff, and you know, they like to be where people aren't. So when you walk around and walk through, um, it's not uncommon to stir it up. So we're going to hopefully go stir some up tonight. Are you upset that we're in here? Down in here? Are you upset that we're in this chamber? I don't understand how they use this. I mean, they just put the water in here and then wooden steps. I mean, this was the, this was it. It wasn't like a liner or nothing. This was it. And then look at it, it's open here. It's just like a, it's like a septic thing. It's like a septic tank, isn't it? Yeah. Is that much. what this is? It's, it's like a septic tank that they're, I mean, it would work. Three feet, four feet. Okay, so it's just over, it's four feet deep to the cement. So am I pissing you off by what I'm saying? I'm just curious. I was baptized. And then so they walked down in here. So how deep do you think they had the water, maybe? Oh, this yeah. high? Even we mark it out four feet here. I mean, what are they, swimming here? Or? Oh, I just need a rat. <laughs> <laughs> it was a rat. Are you but, serious? Like, yeah. Six, six. No. Is it? Oh, it's 66.6. <sighs> We're sitting down in the baptism chamber on the stage that's uh, in front of where the pews would be if they were still here. We're up on the mountainside. And uh, a lot of stairs to bring our equipment up in here tonight. So this is Phil. Oh, something just kind of touched me a little bit here behind me. Something just kind of bumped into the back of my head a little bit. It didn't pull my hair, but it just kind of like uh, felt like a something pushed my hair a little bit. And I thought I was just going to find something behind me, but there's nothing behind me at all. But we are sitting down in the baptism chamber or tub, or so I'm not too surprised that it's gotten some, something's attention being in here. Um, we're getting hits on the mel meter. It's, oh, point one. Point one. Six, six, six. Something is in this church with us. Now it's down to a 63. It was at 66.6 .6 and right around there for a while. Now it's dropped three degrees quickly. Can you feel like that coldness? Did you feel Can you feel that? It's down to 63 again. I just feel a cold presence right here. Right here. And when you can feel something like that change or a shiver, like when you were getting the shivers, always mention it because uh, you know then if something happens right after that you know that you were just feeling something and you've documented it kind of feeling uh, a little something in here with us right now uh, can't describe it I'm getting chills are you getting chills yeah. something it seems like it's in here with us but I'm not seeing anything on the millimeter right now See, you feel that? I don't know where we would get a breeze from in here. Yeah, it's weird. Point 0.8 on the mel. Point 0.7. Can you see any of these? Hmm. Definitely getting hits on the mel meter. A 4. A 4. A 2. Definitely mm -hmm. getting hits on this mel meter here. Point 0.8 and a point 0.7. And you can see how these temperatures fluctuating. Um, like it wants to read a 666. I can feel a little there bit. There it is. I can feel something's in here with us now more than before. It's about midnight. What's the ambient temperature gun say? Can you shoot down in here? We're going to do another walk through this place here in a little bit. Um, we're going to take our night vision camera and see what we catch on that. 65. Something just failed. Something get thrown at us? Did somebody throw something at us? Something just fell in here and I... You don't drop nothing, did you? 
Did you move and kick anything? Did you no, kick anything? I was sitting like this and it hit my foot right there. And there's another reason possible for it. I like to try to keep it real. You know, things following you, you know, you gotta gotta cancel everything out, like maybe Angie accidentally pushed something down or whatever, but we're gonna note it because um I've already felt the back of my head get touched in here. Um, we're getting total spikes on this millimeter. Um, see, now I'm feeling like a cold breeze in here. Are you feeling that? I now felt that, but you was talking. Do you, do you feel it up there? Is it a cold breeze up here, too? Is it just like a breeze maybe coming through the building? Is it coming through the building? Or but where would it breeze down here? Mm-hmm. And maybe coming through this? Maybe. Uh, maybe there's a there's possible that it could be a a draft coming from underneath here somewhere. So we're not going to call that paranormal either. You know we can't document how we're feeling, but we felt the presence down in here. We felt you've gotten the chills when you're really around something that is paranormal. That is going to happen. I mean you will feel it in your body. I don't think that uh, we made something real happy by coming down in the baptism chamber. I have a funny feeling that we might have pissed something off. Um, but we're we're here to get evidence. We're here to see what's going to happen. You know, we go, when the paranormal, we go wherever it's the least comfortable. And, um, you know, we'll go that extra step to get evidence. You know, that's why we're here to collect evidence. We're also using our own bodies as a way to detect it. I mean, if it's evil or not, I mean, no matter what it is, I want that proof. I'm sure I've run into some pretty evil things, and I know I've ran into some sweet, kind things, too, and some loving things. I mean, it's just like the people you run into in this world. There's evil people, there's kind people, there's thoughtful people, there's downright mean, hateful people. It's the same thing in the spirit world. I've, I've learned, and I believe this. You can't judge a book by its cover. People can really be deceiving, and so can these spirits, too. You know, like the devil will, will make himself look like, you know what I mean, very charming. And yet, you know, look what he is. You know what I'm saying? And that's why, like, these demons, too, will, will um, imitate a child, for instance. You know what I mean? And they'll, they'll try to win your confidence over by pretending to be something they're not. So, I mean, you just really never know what you're up against. We're getting hits on these EM meters. Where'd they go to? Um, these blue lights are lighting up. With nobody near them? They're lighting up. Did you see it, Mama? Mm-hmm. So we're getting ready to take another tour with the night vision camera. We're going to go back down the basement. Seems like we're stirring things up now. <laughs> They're hiding. You can't hide from the paranormal. If it wants to go over there and touch you, it's going to go over there and touch you. We're definitely going to go back in that chamber. I think we're going to take this night vision camera on a little tour. Okay, well, let's take a walk. Let's go see what we got.
What happened? That, that door, like, just... What happened? That door went crazy right there. By yourself? Like, I was coming through and it went crazy. It just moved by itself? Yeah, it went crazy. We just had that door move. Get out of here. Go over there by the millimeter. This door just went crazy right here? No, I don't Sure you didn't bump into it? Mm-mm. Who moved this door? Can you do it again? Are you getting hit on the mill? Get the f*** out of here. You didn't touch that? No, I touched the door. So what did it, did you see it moving? Or just heard it? I just heard it. And turned around. And it was shaking still? No, it wasn't shaking. It was supposed to hurt it. Say something hit it. Cool. So something's pissed off that we're here. Who's here yeah. with us? Let's just stay right here where this activity just happened. Um, we're coming through down here, and this door just moved. So, um, who did that? Let's do EVP. Hold still. If anything's here with us, can you move something? Can you talk into our cameras? Did that scare you? That scared the hell out of me. Did it? <laughs> Why? Right here, this door, she said this door just slammed and moved. I mean, you heard me say, what the hell was that? Yeah, I turned to run real fast. Yeah, something, something just moved this door or something very loudly. Something very loudly. We'll hear that on review. I thought you were kicking the door, and I'm thinking, why are you kicking that door? It was loud. Uh, that was cool. It scared me. I was the last one through it. Who did that? Can you talk into the camera? Would you hear a noise? Did that scare you, Mama? Did you see it? I heard it. I'm yeah, we all definitely heard it. It sounded mm -hmm. like you kicked the damn door. Mm -hmm. Can you move something again? Can you do something like that again?